Hi, it's King T here. I hope that you all enjoyed that time lapse. That was actually a couple months ago. I am just really late at making these videos. So this is the building that got showcased in my most recent LEGO City full update with the second floor added. This building is inspired by one that I saw in real life and I think it is coming along very, very nicely. I've officially decided on a name for it. I want to call this the Canyon Center because the whole thing is gonna look like a canyon, especially from all the way down here. It's two entirely separate buildings or towers, you could say, that are connected by a bunch of pathways, which I think is a really neat idea, especially on the one in real life, so I decided to make it out of Lego. This building is going to be a beast, and so many, so many parts have to go into this, especially some expensive ones. You'll notice there are a lot of tiles. Not quite as many as the shopping mall, but this is also a quarter of the size. And there's this pathway that goes through the middle that's all completely tiled off. So a lot of dark gray tiles go into this building. All of the spaces in between the floors are all going to be tiled off so I can take things apart. And even the railings and staircases are going to be tiled off. Maybe not the places where the minifigures are stepping, like over here. Not inside here, but the railings are all tiled off. The other thing that gets expensive is the plant elements, especially anything big. Um, Lego Lego sellers love to charge extra on all of those, and it's kind of annoying. I get it though. And then the last thing about this build is that I've added some minifigures. Um, there's the lady on the walkway, and then the gardener down here. Once this is more complete and I've figured out an actual purpose for the building, I will put more minifigures in it doing their respective jobs and rolls, but until then, this is what I've got right now. You can see the top two floors are empty, which is actually exactly the same with what's on the bottom. Here it is, all taken apart. You can see there's a few design flaws, like these have to come off because they span all the way up the building, which is fine because they're just attached with uh, two studs right on the bottom here. The walkway also does come up, it's just on uh, a couple of jumpers. But you can see that the the bottom floors are also completely empty right now. So if you have suggestions to have an interior, let me know in the comments down below. I would love your suggestions, especially with a unique building design such as this. And that's going to do it for this quick little LEGO update. If you have any suggestions or feedback, let me know in the comments down below. I read all of them. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. And I'll see you in the next one. King T out.